Hello peeps, this is Drakkart with another little redstone tutorial. So again, we are dealing with item elevators or drop evaders. Reason for that is I was messaged like from a guy who mentioned like, ah, he's not good in memorizing designs in redstone. And so he like would just have to have one universal everywhere applicable design that is silent, will never clock up and can be even fed from multiple levels. Like he just has to memorize this one design and it will like always work, right? So I was going like, hmm. Yeah, that's what I came up with. It is, of course, not as resource efficient as the other designs, which are just running on a clock below, uh, because it should be able to get fed on every level, so every single level has to run on its own clock. But I think it's still a pretty, like, decent-sized design. Those are 2 by 5 for each level, and you can, like, put them in every, like, direction like as, as it suits you, right? Let's just show you how this thing works. Like, let me throw 16 redstone in there, and it goes like, doo -doo 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 -doo, blinking, blinking, blinking. Yeah, it kind of does this a lot. It will also like deliver all items, like you put 16 in there, 16 will come up on top. There we go, done. Here we are. And um, yeah, of course, this also works for the other levels. Let's see, like, we throw 16 in here, 16 in there, then we throw 16 in here, then we throw 16 in there. And all do the, the blinking and the, and the, you know, like, busy, busy, busy. But in the end, um, all of the redstone should um, come up here. Oh yeah, it's a trap chest. <laughs> I was like, uh, too dumb to select the, 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 the normal chest. So it's a trap chest. So the, the moment I open it, it basically shuts off the uh, bottom dropper. <laughs> Oh, uh, is lower level done already? There we go! 64, great! Awesome. So, um, yeah, this is basically the design I came up with. So, what do you need? All you need is... Building blocks for redstone for each level, a repeater and a comparator for each level, and the drop operator. All right, so let's say we have like, let's say these three stop elevators should be our um, elevator. Um, now you have to like pick a side. Um, of course, one that is not um, like occupied by a dropper feeding into that thing. Like this side is no longer available. Um, then you like place a block here and place a block next to that thing here like this so you need two space here one for the comparator one for the repeater and then now comes the really tricky part you place one two three four redstone to that other block done this level is like done entirely so uh, now you decide for the next level so how to do that and maybe you go like hmm 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 Here's this redstone laying, so I can't like bridge over here with redstone because you can't put redstone on redstone. But um, hey, how how about we go like um I don't know, like get that thing here and like that, that. Look and. Uh, Comparator, repeater, and now the real tricky part again. One, two, three, four, redstone, done. So yeah, basically that is that is the design I came up with. This thing for itself will like for each level, this runs on a clock and it will power the uh, dropper um, 
constantly as long as our items in there it will be silent and uh, yeah that's basically um the universal item elevator right <laughs> so there you go thanks for watching and um see you next time bye guys